promoting a KKK resurgence is landing an Alabama newspaper editor in hot water. Goodlow Sutton's editorial calls for the Klan to raid communities of liberal politicians. WVTM 13's John Papke shares some of the outrage from Capitol Hill. The headline says it all. Klan needs to write again. In 2019, half a century after the civil rights movement in Alabama, a state newspaper is calling for a Klan revolution. I was just absolutely disgusted. I mean, I just... It is the kind of thing that is just stunning that you could that actually that, that anybody would even say, much less a newspaper publisher and actually put it in print and circulate. The short column appeared in Linden, Alabama's Democrat reporter on Thursday. Editor Goodloe Sutton pushes for the KKK to raid communities of Democratic lawmakers and implied that former slaves rode with the Klan killing evildoers. After reading the editorial on Monday, Senator Doug Jones tweeted his outrage, demanding the editor to resign now. Any newspaper editor uh, is supposed to be a leader in their community would have that kind of attitude and actually publish it. I, I have no idea what the motivation is, but it's sick. Almost two decades ago, Jones prosecuted former Klan members for the 16th Street Baptist Church bombing. His new book on the case comes out in just two weeks. Part of the premise of my book is, is moving past all this, and then you see this coming up and you just get reminded that, you, that we just hadn't, we hadn't quite got there. In published reports, Sutton has defended the editorial. We called his home and office for comment, but could not reach him. Now, Sutton graduated from Southern Miss's communication school. Today, the, the school strongly condemned his KKK call to action column and removed him from the school's Hall of Fame.